Though there are many flags in the 1916 exhibition, the one I find the most interesting is the tricolor flag that was raised above the Mendicity Institute, a charity site taken over by Sean Houston and his troops during the rising to slow the opposition coming up the North Keys. This flag displays a horizontal tricolor, as there was no standard at the time. The most common flag for the rebels would have been a green base with a golden harp. Several examples of this flag are in the exhibition as well. This tricolor, however, helps us to learn the history of the Irish flag and of another Irish rebellion. Thomas Francis Marr was given the Irish tricolor during the 1848 rebellion, drawing inspiration from the French tricolor of blue, white, and red. Just as the French tricolor represents the values they place on freedom, equality, and brotherhood, the Irish tricolor was created to ask that the Irish Catholic and Protestant communities have an everlasting truce, or peace, in the country something rebels did not believe they could have under British rule. Raising flags to represent the new nation was a critical aspect of the rising, and the symbolism of the tricolor became important in subsequent years as Ireland introduced itself to the world separate from Britain. The idea that multiple groups can and should strive to live peacefully together is an important message to take away from this 1916 flag.